this is psychicfuture.com and this is your horoscope from the 3rd to the 9th of February. So this is a really really nice week uh, for all of the signs actually and we are starting off with a new moon in Aquarius which is your opposing sign and this particular new moon is going to be sextile with Neptune and semi sextile with Saturn. So what this is going to do is in particular for you because it is your opposite sign it's going to show us where it is that we need to be applying ourselves, what directions we need to take now, like what kind of new ideas do we need to bring in in order to start achieving our goals and start making 2019 a really good year. Because I don't know if you've noticed, a lot of people that I've spoken with have been like, you know what, January was rubbish. It wasn't the start that I wanted, it wasn't the start that I expected. I was thinking that 2019 would be a really good year because there is so much good planetary energy going about. We've got Jupiter in its home sign of Sagittarius, we've got uh, Neptune in its home sign of Pisces, we've got uh, Saturn in its home sign of Capricorn most of the year. So 2019 is going to be a great year. But January did feel a little bit like, really? Like, it <laughs> doesn't feel like it yet. So this new moon, in particular for you, is going to show you something in some sort of self-reflection or perhaps someone might say something to you that makes you go, oh my god, yeah, that's what I should be doing or that's how I should be thinking or, you know, maybe if I do this then that will happen and I'll get what I want or I'll do what, you know, end up doing the things that I want to do. So it's, it's a very enlightening time, this new moon, so it might help you to perhaps write anything down that comes up during this time. And then the rest of the week is actually going to be really nice as well because we have so many sextiles which are really positive aspects and for you in particular there's one towards the end of the week which is Sun sextile Jupiter. Now that is your ruling planet, the Sun. And it's almost like uh, the moon and the sun are kind of like bookends, right? So we've got this new moon at the beginning of the week and this sun sextile Jupiter at the end of the week. So it's like the, the new moon is kind of showing you like, maybe maybe this I could do better. And then the sun sextile is like at the end of the week is like, okay, now I know how to do this better. Now I can start really putting this into action and I can start really like showing my worth and like living to my full potential. Obviously it's going to be a slow journey and it will take some effort but this is a really nice week for bringing in lots of new opportunities and in particular it is Chinese New Year on February 5th so that is almost like telling us okay well, we'll just forget January because you know, the, the Chinese don't believe that January is part of the new year, they believe we start the new year in February so why not, let's all do that. Um, if you want a bit of extra info about the Chinese New Year you can check out my blog post about Chinese zodiac signs uh, on the Psychic Future website and yeah let's just start from February right because yeah January was a bit slow this week in particular is going to be a really nice one as long as you just keep your eyes open, you know, do a little bit of self reflection and think about things in the kind of wider scheme of what do I want from 2019. So have a lovely week Leos, if you like this video don't forget to like, share and subscribe and I'll see you next week, much love.